the, a believer who is uh, disobedient in this dunya. You have to know that no one will enter uh, Jannah unless he's cleansed from all his sins, right? This is fact number one. Fact number two, no believer will be eternal in, in hell. These are two facts you have to keep in mind. No believer will enter Jannah until he's cleansed from all his sins. And no believer will remain in hellfire uh, eternally. When he's, once he's cleansed from that, he will be admitted into Jannah. Now, the process of cleansing the believer from his sins happens either in this life by means of afflictions, poverty, illness, loss, loss of loved ones, uh, different types of uh, afflictions and hardships, right? Provided he's patient and content, because if he's not, then it's not gonna do him any good, right? If that doesn't work, right? Then once he is in the grave, he will receive punishment in the grave. If that's okay, he's, he's done with cleansing, then he's good after that. If that's not okay, then he will be suffering on the day of resurrection, right? If that is not enough, he will be suffering on the sirat, right? And then thrown into hell, iyadan billah, for cleansing as a final stage. And then once he's pure, he will enter into Jannah.